Good morning, dear children. Would you like to hear the story today of Stone Soup? Once upon a time, there was a farmer who had nothing left to eat. Not a single vegetable in his field. The only thing that he had was a stone. So he took his stone and he dropped it in the pot and he walked down the road to a tiny blue house and he knew that the person who lived there had an onion patch. They thought it very odd to see him walking down the road with a pot and so they came out and said, hello dear farmer, why are you walking down the road with a pot? Oh, said the farmer, it is because I am cooking stone soup. It is the most delicious soup that you will ever eat in the whole wide world, but oh, it would be so much better if only it had an onion. Now, the neighbor with the onion patch did not want to share, but they wanted to taste the stone soup so badly that they chopped the onion and put it in the pot, and then they stirred it all up on down the road, very curious to see what would happen. Next, they came to a big white house, and they knew at this house there was a carrot garden. The carrot gardener came out and said, what are you doing walking down the road with the pot? And they said, we are making stone soup. It is the most delicious soup you will ever have in the whole wide world. But oh, it'd be so much better if only it had some chopped carrots. Now this neighbor wasn't sure she wanted to share her carrots, but she also wanted to try stone soup. So they peeled the carrots and they chopped them up and they added them to the pot and they took their spoon and they stirred the soup and walked on down the road together until they came to a medium-sized greenhouse where they knew there was a large potato field. The potato farmer came out and said, what are you doing walking down the road with this funny pot? They said, we are making stone soup. It is the very best soup in the whole wide world, but oh, it would be so much better if only it had just a few chopped potatoes in it. And the potato farmer very much wanted to try the stone soup. So together they peeled the potatoes and they chopped them up and they added them to the soup and they took their spoon and they stirred it all up and they all walked down the road together until they came to a little yellow house. And the owner of the little yellow house came out and said, what in the world are you doing walking around with a pot? And all the friends now said, oh, we are making stone soup. It is the very best soup in the whole wide world. There is so much tasting. If only, if only we had a little bit of broccoli. Now, the person who lived in the yellow house was very, very fond of broccoli. And they said, well, I will bring you some broccoli. So they chopped broccoli and they added it to the pot and they took the spoon and they stirred it all up and then they cooked it over a warm fire and cooked it and cooked it and cooked it and then they tasted it and everyone agreed that it was the very best soup in the whole why?